Hello everyone, in this video we will show you how to configure a VPN channel between Vigor2860 and Vigor3900 using PPTP. Here we have the network topology that will be used for the VPN configuration. We will start by configuring Vigor2860. Use your internet browser to log into the router. Check if you are connected to the internet. Go to online status and then physical connection. You can see that one one is connected. Now go to VPN and remote access and then LAN to LAN configuration menu. Select the first available index to start the configuration. Enter a profile name. Select enable this profile and then dial in since we want this router to be a server. Under dial-in settings, select PPTP and enter your chosen PPTP username and password. Under TCP IP network, enter the remote network IP which is the local IP address of the Vigor 3900. Click OK to save your settings. The next step is to configure Vigor3900. Log in to the router and use the default username and password. Check if you are connected to the internet. As you can see, 1-2 is connected. Now go to VPN and Remote Access. Select VPN Profiles. In the VPN Profile page, Select PPTP Dial Out tab and click Add. Enter a profile name and select Enable. Enable Always On. Select the interface the VPN tunnel is going to use. Enter the server IP. This is your one IP of your Vigor 2860. Enter the same PPTP username and password that you use in your Vigor 2860. Enter local IP and subnet mask and then click Add to enter remote IP and subnet mask. Click Apply to save your settings. Test that the VPN connection is running. We go to VPN and Remote Access and then go to Connection Management. As you can see, we are now connected. Another way is to ping the IP address of Vigor2860. Thank you for watching the video. For more information, you can visit our website at www.greatech.com.au or you can also send us an email to sales at